Another question uh, we get asked a lot, Siobhan, is that tricky, that tricky question in an interview where, where the, a newly qualified accountant might be asked, uh, what are your salary expectations? Yeah. What's your advice there? Should, should they ask for 100K straight away or what, what do you think? Yeah, so look, um, I guess, you know, it's my main advice would be to practice this question in advance. I wouldn't like to ask for 100,000. You might see the door quicker than you, than you had hoped. Um, but yeah, look, my main advice is to practice this question. We know it's probably going to come up. So it's one that you can have practiced um, before you go into interview. It can be a bit of an awkward or an uncom uncomfortable one when you're in interview. I suppose I advise people firstly to assess again, and I'm like a broken record, but how closely aligned their experience is with the role and what exactly the client is looking for compared to other candidates that they may be competing against for the role. Um, if you're missing a lot of the experience, it might not be the best, it might not be the best idea to ask for the higher end of the salary range on offer. What I most commonly advise people to say is. I've been advised that the newly qualified market rate, the newly qualified market rate here in Cork is between A and B. Because I have X, Y, and Z experience, I would be ideally looking for the higher end of that scale. However, while salary is of course important to me, the role itself, the learning, and the company and the opportunities within the company um, are what my key priorities are. If you don't take a number of the boxes, for example, um, you could say something like, while I may not have experience in X and Y, I have a very strong work ethic and I would work really hard to overcome any gaps in my experience that there may be. You don't want to be ruled out of a job because you chance your arm at, to ask for a higher salary. Yes, the risk can pay off at times, but it's completely up to you if you're willing to take the risk of the employer thinking your sole priority is money. And it can sometimes be off-putting as well for the hiring manager. Mm -hmm.